All right. How's everybody feeling today? A little bit, a little bit sore, but in a good way. So today's workout is our Virtual Local Box workout number two. Um, how many of you guys participated in the first workout last week? Remember that it was snatching, push-ups, I did. Squats? I did. Ten minute Amra. Cool. <clears throat> so just a recap of what Support Your Local Box is. It's a uh, online competition that CrossFit Headquarters has put out to help support um, CrossFit gyms around the world that may be struggling financially at this time. And um, the, it is free to participate. And then there's an option to donate to your local affiliate if you'd like to. Um, but what, what we're really feeling is that the reason we really wanted to support this was more just to help us feel united and to have like a common goal, have something that we're all working on together. So that's probably the biggest thing that we've noticed um, with this closure is we just, we aren't able to see each other. We're not able to work out together. So we want to have that sense of community still. So um, this. Zoom calls have really helped though, being with people online each day. It's yeah. been fun. All right. So our workout today is um, a shorter one if you have double unders. If not, then we can scale it appropriately. There is a 15 minute time cap. But the workout itself is, we're starting with 100 double unders. Then we're moving on to 21 burpees, 75 double unders, 15 burpees, 50 dubs, nine burpees. So just two movements. They're both high heart rate movements. So we will want to kind of pay attention to where we want to push and where we want to um, scale back a little bit. So like if you're really good at double unders, maybe you want to go a little slower on the, on the burpees. However, if double unders are something that you start to trip a lot when you're fatigued, then maybe um, go a little bit faster here, take a quick break and then get onto your dubs. Okay. Or have purposeful breaks on your dubs. Maybe 20 is a number that you feel really confident in getting. So just do 20, purposely rest, shake those arms out. 20, purposely rest, shake your arms out, okay? So I did work out this morning. Chris wants me to do it again for you. <laughs> <laughs> what, might... if you don't, what if you don't have that many dubs? Yeah, so, that, so the scaling options, let's talk about that. First of all, if you don't have a jump rope, you can do, a couple of, you can do those penguin taps or you can just do jumping okay if you don't have a rope if you have a rope and you're okay at dubs or let's say like 50 is a number that is like your max then scale it down to like 50 40 30 just pick a number that you think you can get but not necessarily unbroken like getting 100 double unders unbroken is awesome but there's not a lot of people that have that and so think of it as maybe like three sets. So whatever you think you can do in three sets. Does that make sense here? Whatever that workout was last week, we had a lot of double unders. Like I think it took me like two minutes and 45 seconds to do 100. Like I can do them. Should I just try and do them since I did them last week? It just might take me a while. Yeah, yeah okay. and that's, that's probably, I mean, you guys get to choose. If there's a 15 minute time cap. Okay. So this workout could take anywhere from five minutes to 15 minutes. But if you okay. think you can do all of that work in under 15 minutes, then I would challenge you to do it. All right. Okay, I'll try. We'll see. What I want to do is I want to <coughs> check Pierce and do jumping jacks and see if who can win. <laughs> there you go. I love jumping, jumping jacks. Jumping jacks or devil. <laughs> awesome. Fast at burpees. She is faster at burpees. Do we? Austin and Carrie online too. Dustin said, this is a good time to practice double unders when nobody's watching you. So, but I, I think, think everyone would be watching me, so I'm doing jumping jacks. I think this is a good time to go for a run. <laughs> <laughs> well, guess what? We have running today, too, so. Yep. 
So your wish is granted. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Do you think it works out? It's do we singles at all? Sorry, what? Sue? All right. Should we do singles at yeah. all? Yeah. So then the other option would double the number and do singles. So yeah, those are your three options. You can do it however you want. Um, Talon, is Courtney with you? Is your mom with you? Hold on, you're muted. Uh, she's taking care of the girls. Oh, okay. Do you guys have jump ropes or no? I do, I do yeah. Okay. He does, but it's not, not a great one. And it's okay. like, yeah, she's okay. So, so gonna you're going to do what? Jumping jack. Okay, perfect. Awesome. All right, so let's go ahead and get started with, we have a general warm up and then we have a specific warm up. So our, our, we're gonna start with uh, Tabata of four movements. We're gonna go through it twice. So we're gonna start with um, just hops. So straight up and down hops. Then we'll do some scat push-ups, air squats, mountain climbers. The second time we go through it, we're gonna do um, plate hops or the penguin, the penguin hops that I was just showing you. And I'll do these with you so you guys can see. You don't have to memorize it all. Then we'll do regular push-ups, air squats, mountain climbers, okay? So I'll start the clock. <clears throat> uh, yes, please. Right, our regular hops. Three, two, one, go. So warm your calves up nice and good for those double ones. We're going to go into a scat push up, which is just you're moving your shoulders up and down your face. And our last one is mountain climbers. <coughs> Go ahead and start your mountain climbing. to air squats, maybe speeding it up just a little bit. Okay. 
And then mount climbers. All right, guys, heart rate should be up just a little bit. You should be feeling nice and warm throughout your body. We are going to move on to our specific warm up. So, let me show you what it looks like. Jimbo says, Can't wait to see those dubs, Chris. Yeah. So, we are going to do our penguin drill. This is what we did in the warm up. However, if you already know how to do double unders, we're gonna skip this part, and you're gonna go on to these single doubles. So we're gonna start with three one, so three singles, one double. Then once you have that, you're gonna do a couple of those. Then we'll move on to two and one. Once you have that, we're gonna try and do one and one. And what this does is it helps with rope control. You're focusing on being able to identify where the rope is at all times, so that when you start to get tired in a workout and you can feel your rope starting to slow down, you can feel that and speed up or jump higher, okay? Or take a break. What, what I want you to focus on when you're doing your dubs is keeping your elbows nice and close to your body and rotating at the wrist. Your arms should be slightly in front of you here, rotating at the wrist, elbows are tight, and the arm is just slightly bent. So it's not locked out, but we're not rotating here. We're rotating here, okay? So we're gonna spend two or three minutes doing that. And then we will move on to some burpee technique and some scaling options for burpees as well. So go ahead and grab your rope and I will watch you guys. Push you one side. Single doubles. I have been getting improvement on these lately, Jimbo. I did get over 40 this week, but I still don't think I'm at 100 for this workout. Let's move on to the burpees. We'll do just a slow burpee to start with. We'll get down, do a step up burpee. Get up, do a couple of those, then we'll go into normal burpees. Step up, kind of stretch out those hips, get ready for What's coming up? John Murphy. Oh, okay. Well, we did it for like two minutes. We're going to do a couple rounds of that, or what are we? Gonna well, do? I was going to have him work on double image for a while, but. Okay. Well, we moved on to the burpees. Okay. Sorry, I had to go to the bathroom, so I don't know what, where you guys are at. I'm going to unmute you really quick. Okay. Does anybody feel like they need help with dubs? That looks good, too. Yeah, I like the three in one. It's okay. the, the one in one. 
<laughs> the one-on-one. -on -one. Well, that's another option too. Let's say you want to do dubs, but the stringing together is hard for you, then you can always do single, double, single, double, or two singles, a double. So the main purpose of the single, double, single, double is I want you guys to see how the jump stays about the same. You, you, slightly, you jump slightly higher, but like my arms are gonna look the same. I'm still gonna rotate at the wrist. Everything looks the same, whether I'm singling or doubling. So three goals. How do I make it so these are across the top? I can't see everybody. Do you have a rope? Austin. How you okay. Doing? So you just doing your like pretending. Okay. I can hear you. Kimberly, how are you on dubs? I stink. <laughs> so that was the best I've done in a long time. Good. Cool. Okay, I like how your arms are not rotating. You're rotating really well at the wrist, too. Your arms are a little bit high, like I would like them better down by your legs, but you are rotating at the wrist, which is really good. Yeah, that was good. That was it. That was the best of the day. <laughs> What's your plan? Um, I'm just going to try and do all the double unders. Okay. So yeah. when you get tired, this is what I usually <laughs> Your rope is getting shorter. So keep them right here. Okay. Really nice and tight. I like, okay. one thing that helped me a lot is somebody told me to flex my triceps. So I oh. flex my triceps and that forces me to rotate at the wrist. Okay. We'll see. Okay. So did you go over the um, scaling options for burpees? Yeah. Okay, so a couple options for your burpees. Think smooth as possible. <clears throat> we want to find a consistent, steady pace. So there are a couple things you can do. You can just tap. Uh, or if you're starting to fatigue and you'd rather just keep moving, <laughs> step up, step up. Okay. That's why you can slow your heart rate down a little bit, but keep the momentum going. If burpees aren't an option for you, you can do those up downs that we've been doing. You can jump back, jump up, or step back, step up. That's another option. So a couple pregnant girls that go to our gym, so obviously they're not going to go down on their belly. So that's what I would do. Okay. All right, I'm gonna give everybody like one minute to get a bathroom break in because we can all you, need one. Can you show us the workout again? I wanna read. So what am I going to do? Show them. Oh, so you can rewrite this down. So I'm trying to figure out how to scale it because I don't think it, I, I can't do a hundred deaths, so. I'm gonna do jumping jacks, and I'm I'm perfectly good with that. Really? <laughs> the the goal like is to uh, keep on moving. So it's supposed to be an intense workout. So for me, if I do the dubs, I'm just gonna trip up, and it's gonna be a 
really cool workout. So that's what, what I'm choosing to do. And I want to see if I can beat Tirso during jumping jacks. Awesome. I love it. I think it'll be fun. Thanks. I'm def I've definitely been getting improvement on the dubs more than I ever have the last couple of weeks. So it's been, I don't know if you guys have been practicing too, but it's, it's improving. Yeah, but my improvement is like 20 dubs in a row. <laughs> yeah, no, that's the start. <laughs> that's where I was at before this, and I hit like, I hit a right, right around 40 the other day. I think it was wow. 38. So. Nice. But I was so out of breath by the time I finished it that I, yeah. I was having a hard time getting, getting them going again. Yeah, and then to do burpees. Burpees is where I lose my air. Yeah. Yeah, I've, I'll probably be taking a lot of breaks. I've never really done up downs until recently. And I think those are sure a good scale for people that are dying on burpees. I like those a lot. <laughs> really good. So don't, don't be afraid to do those. I think okay. they're a good, good thing to do. You're going to get, get a lot from the burpees. You'll get a lot more from the burpees. But I think if it's hard for you to move fast on the burpees, I think up downs are a good option. Okay, that's a good idea. I might just do that. I would, I would think do, do what you can do today that's going to make it more intense because the intensity is where the money's at. This should you feel know? very frannish. <laughs> Your lungs should hurt. <laughs> oh, yay. <I'm> sure. <laughs> I don't know what fran is. You're going too soon. <laughs> Everyone get that? Yep. Yeah. I want you guys all to know that I did not know he was redoing this workout, so it will be number two for me. Today. You got you to gotta be prepared for the unknown and the unknowable, so I was just trying to help her out this morning. My shoulders are going to hurt. Where do you want to go? Right there? You're not going to be in the video right there, though. My uh, do not. Okay, you guys ready? Yeah. All right, I'm gonna mute you all.
Can't hear you. Can't hear you. Nothing. You mute it. Oh. There you go. Sorry. You didn't want to hear me breathe and moan. Oh. Nice job, you guys. Keep it up. Amy, 454. Two times. Woo. Nice, Kimberly. Good job, Chris. Keep it up. You guys are doing good. Give me one second, Jack. Mm, no. Talon, are you done? Yeah. Nice job. Good job, Courtney. Keep it up. Good job, Talon. Thank you. Here we go, Kyle. Oh. Nice job, Kimberly. Keep moving. <laughs> how'd, you do? how'd you do? 657. Good job. Kyle, how'd you do? Did you see the did you see the clock at the end? Yeah, 713. Okay. okay. Nice job. Oh, that was rough. <laughs> you killed it. Whooped me. Throw that on. <sighs> All right. Good job, Courtney. Way to go, girl. All right, Sue and Emily still going. Let's cheer them on. Good job, Sarah. <sighs> Let's go, ladies. Woo! Fun. Nice job, Sue. Uh, is this Emily? Yeah. Emily. Emily. Nice work, Emily. Let's go, ladies. You got this. Got this Emily. Almost oh. there. Almost there. Yeah. All right, Sue. Smooth is fast. Looking good, Emily. Nice job, Sue. Hey, Emily, you got this, girl. Here we go. Work. Good, Emily. She on the nice. All done. Nice job, Emily. Nice job, Emily. Good job, Everyone's you guys. Done. How are you nice feeling? Work. Did you guys both feel skilled? Did you guys feel like you scaled accordingly to? Do you feel like you did a good job on your scale <laughs> options? Yeah. Good. I can do a double under with my jump rope. I can do them with the ones at the gym, but. I don't know if I have this one too long or something, but I can even. Yeah, you long. might. You might. I can help you with that too. Okay. Look at the size of it. All right, guys. Well, good job on that. So if you are signed up for that um, Support Your Local Box, make sure you put your score in at on the website. And then, of course, record it on our Wattify. In Wattify. Emily, did you do Spartan last night? tired i like got on at the beginning to watch and then i didn't do it it was killer it was so good if you guys yeah, i need to try it one of these times it looked hard it was good i've never done devil presses before that oh they were rough. i don't think i have either that makes burpees seem a lot easier <laughs> okay guys we're not done we've got some aerobic capacity that we're going to do today so we only have 20 <clears throat> minutes 
So what we're going to do is on the three minute mark, we're gonna do 400 meter run. So we're gonna do a 400 meter run. You'll rest until the three minute mark and we'll do another 400. We're gonna do six rounds of that, okay? So we're gonna move you guys outside. Chris, I think we should sign off. <coughs> So, you guys are going to come outside. <coughs> for a run. Okay. Bye. Thanks for coming. Okay. No, I just want um, my shoes. Well, if we sign off here, let's just tell everyone and they can do it on their own. Yep. Here you go. Hey, Brett. How you doing? Okay. I'm going to take you guys outside. Holy crap, I am drenched. Anybody else? All right. It's luckily still a very beautiful day. Oh. Does everybody have a watch that they can use to time themselves on this? Yes. All right. And then also, you're going to want to record each round, how long each round is taking you. Right, there will be a place in Wattify that you can score your- Hey, girl. Okay. Okay. All right, I am going to, can you guys give me one minute? I gotta switch my shoes out real quick. Okay, hold on. Ready, All right. Coming? Okay, we're just waiting on Chris. Ready? Yeah. Okay, guys, we're going to get started. Do you have a timer? Yeah. Okay. All right, here we go. In three, two, one, go.
Do I put it up on the tire? 142. What was that? 142. I swear, guys. Kyle has us running with him. Nice job. So the goal with all of this is to keep consistency. Because uh, you can stand up here. Stop, Kyle. Here we out on time, sirs. 30 seconds. 30 seconds before we go again. So the goal, Kyle, is keep that pace. Talon, okay. keep that pace. Okay. Nervous? Okay. Nice job, Courtney. Seconds. Okay. Nice job, Kimberly. Do you run a lot, Kimberly? No. Not really? I uh, bike. Ride a bike. Yeah. You more a cyclist then, or? Yeah. I see the bike. The garages are very similar. I'm not sure I'm running as far as 400. I'm not sure how far that is, but I'm going to just try to keep hitting the same spot. And see what That's all right. You, the time that you're doing is great. It's supposed to be aerobic, not like all out, too. Not, not like a burpee workout. 20 seconds, guys. Let's try and control that heart rate.
Work. Close that one. Let's drop Talon. How long are those taking you? Uh, I don't know. Two minutes? Probably a little faster than that. You're holding a good pace. Nice job, Emily, Courtney. Thanks. Kimberly. So since this is aerobic, you want to be able to recover a little in between these. So run, if you have to run 300 meters, it's okay. You just want to be able to get that recovery going. We only got three more guys. Almost there. <laughs> three. We got this girl. Running's good Woo! for cycling too. Four seconds guys. Ten seconds. All right. You're in the garage. All right, here we go in three, two, one. Thirteen. good. Whew. Nice job, guys. Whew. All right, big deep breaths. Try and control that three. Bring it down. We got this. How much time? 20? Got 20 seconds. Five. Three. 
work. Nice job, Courtney. Talent. Kimberly. Five seconds. This is, last the one. This is the last one. Yeah. Let's make this one our fastest. And it's strong. We got 15 seconds. Woo! You guys are awesome to do that hard workout and then this. I Let's bet you there. half the people skip out on the aerobic capacity. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Nice. Nice work. Kimberly's done. 
Talon's done. Courtney's done. Good job, Kyle. Keep it moving. Oh. Nice job, Emily. Nice job, Kyle. That was a good, hard okay. workout. What'd you guys think? Yeah. It was like a straight, straight up lung burner. It what? Straight up lung burner. Yeah. All lungs and shoulders. <sighs> Woo! All right, guys. Before you sign off, you've got what time is it? Eight fifty-nine. Okay, we got one minute. We're gonna stretch our calves out. One minute. So either go into a downward dog or put your leg up against a wall, something like that, where you can get a good stretch in your Achilles and your calf. So we are looking for, if you do a straight leg, no bend in the knee, you're going to get more of a calf stretch. If you bend at the knee, you'll feel it more in your Achilles. This is what I'm looking for. Dog, you need to be yeah. Mm -hmm. leg, it's gonna be higher calf. If you bend your knee, you're gonna feel it lower here. That's good. awesome class nice work you guys if you guys are drenched like me then at least i'm not alone right <sighs> so good if you want to improve your running too we have two workouts we put on a week that are similar to that we do a lot of aerobic capacity training and they're outside <sighs> under the blog and running workouts and it'll help you with crossfit a ton <sighs> Cool. I gotta get better at running. Bye. Thank you. Thanks Bye, a lot. Emily. See you. Bye. Thanks, guys. Bye, Bye guys. Good job, everybody. You too. Bye. Nice job, Talon and Courtney. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye.